let us discuss about nor gate nor gate means not or gate in a nor gate an or gate is inverted through a nor gate actually an inverted or operation is nor operation and the logic gate that performs this operation is called nor gate the basic logic construction of the nor gate is shown here the symbol of nor gate is similar to or gate but one bubble is drawn at the output point of the or gate in the case of nor gate the true stable of a nor gate is shown here Here output is whole bar of a plus b. Here when a and b both are zero, the output is one. When a is zero and b is one, the output is zero. When a is one and b is zero, the output is zero. And when both a and b are one, the output is zero. nor gate means not an or gate which means output of this gate is just reverse of that of a similar or gate we know that output of an or gate is zero only when all inputs of or gate is zero but in the case of nor gate the output is one only when all inputs are zero Now we will discuss about resistor transistor logical gate. A nor gate can be realized by using two bipolar junction transistors. The basic circuit is as shown. This circuit is made by two parallel connector transistors. In the circuit when both A and B are given plus 5 volt base of the both transistors get quite a high potential to make the transistors on as both T1 and T2 are in on condition supply voltage at terminal C gets passed to the ground through resistor R entire supply voltage ideally drops across resistor R and the output terminal of the circuit will not get any voltage and hence it will be at logical zero state practically a transistor cannot be ideally short circuited in on condition there will be a voltage drop between emitter and collector of the transistor even in on condition so practically entire supply voltage will not drop across resistor r instead a small portion of it and that may be 0.6 volt is dropped across saturated transistor that is 5 minus 0.6 that equals 4.4 volts hence voltage appears at output terminal x is not practically zero instead it will be 0.6 volts which is considered as logical zero now if either of inputs a and b is given with plus 5 volts the only corresponding transistor will be in on condition but in this case also supply voltage will get passed to the ground through r and on transistor and similarly the output will be in logical zero states which is 0.6 volts now if both of the inputs a and b are given with zero volt or grounded both transistors will be in off condition as in this case the base of both transistors does not have enough potential to make the transistors on as the supply voltage will not get any path to the ground the supply voltage will appear at output x hence output is in logical one or high state hence in the circuit the output is one only when both of the inputs are zero 
and in all other conditions the output is zero.